put the group ahead of me right now. This is about them, but uh, certainly excited. You know, it's not easy to, uh, you know, these accomplishments are tough. Certainly happy for all of our alum and friends of AIC Hockey. So it's a, it's a shared moment for all. And um, just couldn't be more excited for our guys. They, they, uh, they put the work in. They uh, have a belief to them. And um, I'm glad we're able to do this. Oh, it feels unreal. Uh, we've had some big wins over the last uh, last couple of years, but uh, this is definitely number one. And it was special to do it with uh, this group of guys and my family here as well. So, um, yeah, I'm extremely happy right now. It's pretty crazy what's going on right now. Just to be a part of something like this is special. Have my family here and all that, it means a lot. Um, but like I said, it's a special moment in AIC history, and we're, we're all cherish it for the rest of our lives. We talked early in the game that there's going to be some emotional momentum swings and we just wanted to stay with we wanted to be intense we just wanted to just you know try and have our team here and um, we were able to weather a couple storms credit Sacred Heart they came out played really hard had us on our heels a little bit and then I thought we got our feet underneath us and um, our special teams were spectacular two monster power play goals our penalty kill was outstanding Zach Skog was very good and um, just sort of just a uh, part of a, a really solid 50 minute effort you know I gotta give you know Sacred Heart a little credit here as well they they make it hard they're a really really good team just uh, stuck to the things that uh, we want to do going into the game didn't get deterred uh, when they scored a goal um, and then found our legs battled a little harder competed a little harder was stiffer on our sticks and then uh, the, uh, the ice kind of tilted our way we talk in terms of um, we this, the standard of AIC hockey doesn't change, whether we're playing a, a, a game in October, November, a game that has a lot of meaning like tonight, we have to be able to, to stay the course and, and be the same all the time. You can't turn it on and off and um, irrelevant of our opponent um, coming up here. Um, you know, th things really won't change for us. The nice thing is, is that we'll be pretty healthy in two weeks from now. We'll, we'll probably get Hugo Reinhardt back and Brendan Kapchak back. Uh, those two guys. If you can add your your, your top line center and your top defenseman, um, I think it's going to set up well for us. Yeah, uh, special teams win you hockey games. That's uh, that's the bottom line. And ours was good tonight. Put both our power play and our kill. So it was good to see that, and we're going to need that uh, going forward in the playoffs here. Yeah, well, playoff hockey is a different animal. Everyone's got to step their game up, take it to another level. Uh, if we don't do that, then uh, we're, our season's going to be over pretty quick, and we'll be disappointed with the results. But uh, I believe in this team, and I think we got, to got what it takes to get the job done here. Uh, we're going to be preparing hard, and uh, expectations are that uh, that we get the job done and get to uh, get to Buffalo. I don't have uh, I don't have that what if moment right now. I I know when we got here three years ago, we talked about crawl, walk, run, and we had to get this program competitive, which is what we did in year one, and, and then the walk version of, of what we what we did last year is a whole nice advantage games we ever had and you know you look into this year and you know we're not sure if we're ready to run sprint and uh, we've been a combination of both here so um, you know the credit is, is to to the guys in there and, and the belief and you know they're proud to be yellow jackets and uh, that's what I'm most proud of